All right, so I watched season two of She's Gotta Have It yesterday, and um, I'm kind of disappointed. One, I ran through, the, I think the episodes are like 30 minutes. I ran through it like in a breeze. There's like nine episodes, I believe, nine or ten episodes. And um, it really didn't live up to the hype. Like, I saw season one, and I was in love. Like, I was going crazy waiting for season two, and then I finally watched It's like, that's what I was waiting for. <sighs> the storyline, the plot, it was it was kind of trash for season two. Um, I remember there was so much... There was so much power behind the, the plot in season one, like when she couldn't make rent things you you felt the immediate threat when she when she couldn't make her rent or you know her trying to figure out how to bring money into her home so you felt that in season one in season two it's like yeah it's still an issue but it, it they didn't make it seem like it was an issue everybody was all laughing and happy and stuff and I didn't like that the one thing I will say is visually it is remarkable it's like everything is shot so beautifully the the music is awesome the the cinematography is amazing like spike lee really does his thing so you can watch it on mute and just be like in awe of how beautiful it is but the plot is is kind of thin and like, I, I would, probably wouldn't watch if there's a season three just because everything is so dried up. Like, all the lovers are just, yeah, there's still a lot of sex. Like, no, not, not like season one. Season one was like every single frame was sex. But season two, it was a lot milder. It was a lot tamer. It was just not it. Like, if you love season one and you just want to keep watching just because you've already invested a time I say yeah go ahead and watch it but like I definitely don't like it so season two is definitely like a one and a quarter out of five where season one was more like three and a quarter so it definitely dropped in the ratings for me I doubt Netflix would bring it back for a season three because it just sucked and I'm pretty sure everybody will let it know that they didn't like it but I'll be surprised if it comes back for a season three it was just terrible to me